Hello and welcome back. So since my online little meltdown, right, don't ask me how I've got to this because it's too long a story. But what I was thinking was, um, what led me to this, when I was saying about the twin flames, right, well, I, a couple of times here and there, I've been, you know, like they'll find you, but I've been saying, I've been getting messages like, it, it, it's almost to find your twin flame, right? So I thought, well, how do you, do you go about finding your twin flame when you know nothing about them? Simple, I'll ask, right? You're going to like this. It's made me howl. I've already, I already asked. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to be able to tell you who, who, who they are, what their traits are to you. I've already done Brandon Flowers, right? He was a good match for me up in the ethers, right? We were swans. Um, but he, he's married, so that's why he's not going on the list. Because I can't have that on the list, can I? At least the last I know, he's married. And the only difference between his one's church, which he is very church, and one's spiritual. So that's for somebody out there, right? One's very church, one very spiritual. This is in the twin flame thing. So I don't even know why I'm talking twin flame. It's a soulmate. We're all soulmates. What's this? Protection. Yes, we have protection. We have protection all the time when you're trying to do all right. Right. Or ask for protection. All right. I forget to do that, you know. Yes, please. Protect me. Uh, Archangel Michael, he fancies me. So, <laughs> fancies the pants off. So, he never leaves my side. <laughs> Right, I don't know what these are. So, the first person, think of somebody who, who you think would be your twin flame, could be your twin flame, right? And I'll tell you the situation with it. I'll, it's three cards, that's for each one. I don't know how many I'm doing, I don't know what I'm doing. I've just come up with it. So, get your first person, it can be anybody, anybody in the world, right? And let's see who it is. Oh, hang on. Before I turn the cards over, I have to pick one, don't I? Right. Um, no. Justin Timberlake's married. All oh, right. I've got one. Right, this is my first one. Possibly yours. Oh, my word. This person, right... That you've just thought of he is an emperor right now now don't get too excited because there's lots of emperors and empresses right emperors and empresses but the one that you were just thinking of right is an emperor he he is very passionate right <laughs> he is very passionate let me see this see if i can do it good uh, ah, yes, this, ah, eight, right, are, are the world of the emotions, right, so this person, I don't, it's just fell out, I don't know who it is, I think I have to keep it, I'm scared, of, I'm scared, right, so this would be for me, um, what it is, is he has just gone through, something came at them sideways and he's just gone through emotional growth, right? Um, and th there's a feeling around this person that um, you, you would get um, what you least expect. Like you may think, you, you know this person, um, but it would be least what you expect. 
and possibly surprising, right? Because, um, I mean, the ones he has got fire and passion in him because I just learned that he, um, he, he paints and he paints perfectly. It's fantastic. You wouldn't have thought. He uses the energy and channels it like that. The same with his acting. So, and he's taking action. So, this one is, <laughs> I'll tell you what he is. Oh, he's an eagle. He is the all-seeing eagle. Oh, now then, these choices are going to get hard, you know, girls. So, he was, he is the eagle who's going to come along and swoop the lamb. <laughs> Slamming your lamb. That's what you've that's what he's going to do, slamming the lamb. And it's, yes, it is most surprising because it was Johnny Depp. That one was <laughs> that one was Johnny Depp because he's a survivor, right? He just survives and goes along in his merry old little land. Right, on to the next one. Choose another one, right? I like this game. You could do it a few different ways as well. Right. The second one. Who am I doing? Oh. Right. Which one? Which one? I'll save that one for later. Right. I know which one. I nearly said it. Right. So this second. Um. This second one. What would. I mean. I don't know, what would he think of you? What would he think of me? What this, this second one are you thinking of, right, is they, they can see you, they, they, they'll be able to see when you are moving away from conflict. Um, they can see this happening to you. Um, they can see you going from the light to the dark. You've crossed a bridge. Um, uh, and they think this is justice for you. Um, because it is. You go over any bridge in any doors, right? Through any portals, right? It's justice in one way or another. He can, this one is able to see the truth and the clarity within you, yeah? Um, there's no, there's no swords, there's no hearts, um, although they do know, because this six of swords is sometimes like, I've had this come out a few times this morning, it wants to be out just like the threes um it's like they can see that that you are almost you're almost glad to be walking away from all all that everything that you're leaving behind you're glad and then they know this right but what personality are they though why would they want to match with me <laughs> this is what you do, right? Well, you are the punchline, my word. Right, so, what personality is this? No, it was going to give me two. I don't know if they're a Gemini. But, oh, oh they've got two faces. I could, yeah, I could understand that. He's a starfish, right? He's a starfish. Let's have a look. Of the water, of the emotions. Oh, well, yeah. He can cut through. He can see, look at all all on this card, right? It's um, it's all cleared. All that maelstrom has cleared what's in some of these cards. It's all cleared. And uh, and that's the sword he's wielded to cut through it all. He can, this person that you are thinking of is able to... To understand you like this, they can see, because he's a starfish. 
I think he's done the same things. And I'll tell you what, it might be surprising. I'll tell you why I said that. Because, right, this person has an absolute wicked sense of humour that I don't think many realise. Um, but you can see, you can actually see the humour in him. Um, yeah, I mean, sometimes you can think, is it superficial or is it shallow because a starfish is alluring, aren't they? But when, when they're in balance, when this person in balance, right, they are uplifting, they're artistic and they are expressive, right? Um, when they get out of balance, when he gets out of balance, I didn't know this about him, right? He gossips and he can feel empty. So when that happens to you, right, <laughs> Mr. Tom Hiddleston, that's that one, right? When that happens to you, you have to be around positive friends. So he's the starfish. Right. Now then, on to the, should we do another one? So what have we got? I've got Brandon Flowers that is a match. I've got, who was that one? Got Johnny Depp is an emperor though, isn't he? He's the first one out the gate actually, because he's a survivor. So he's good. Tom understands everything, and he's hidden talents and humour and heart. And now we're gonna go to. Oh, this is a good one. Right, this person, right, so I'll, which way round am I going to do this person? This person, right, what would be the match with this person? This is what I'm saying, you're going to have to do something. If we're, suppo if we're supposed to find them, right, we can do this. Get your next person in your head and I'll tell you whether they're all right or not. I'm telling you what as well, if, 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 if a deer comes out of that today, I am not crying no more if they throw another deer at me. Because it hurts when that heart opens right up. Whoa, I've dropped these cards. I only said two and it's got, oh God. I, oh no, they, uh oh. I've dropped these cards. It's just three of them again when I said each one was only going to get two. So we're going to just mind your own business, Elaine, and do it how we want you to do it. So this person that I have chosen, right, he, this person thinks, would, would think or feel with me, right, that he could have the best fun ever. Right? That's what he would think. So, whoever person you're thinking of now, right, that person would get you. Do you understand? They, they, would, they would be so grateful and, and just so in awe and just so love, look at you with such love, right? Like, I'll say it in a minute. But that's what they would think about you you would be so much fun and, and they also with the moon it's like um the emotions as well they can go down there they understand that they've done the work and, and yes he's a star but they would think they think that you are a star. Everyone's a star. You come from the stars. So I'll tell you what this person is, right? Because <laughs> because this person, right, who's known me, who would know and 
understand all what's going on with you. They, they think you're a star, right? Everybody meets him. Everybody meets him because he's Joe Black, right? This is who I was thinking of, Brad Pitt. I mean, come on, he's Achilles, right? And he can backward live. I, I love his heel. His heel is glorious. <laughs> and you see them two wolves howling at the moon, right? Howling at me, yeah? Because there's already, I've already eliminated one of you. And I'll tell you exactly who Brad Pitt is. He's an oyster. He's the, oh, he's the pearl amongst them all. Give us, let's have a look. There's just so many choices, isn't there? Who's your third person? Because whoever it is, it's a good old match. Where's the oysters? Give me the pearls. I like pearls. I've been finding them all over. The oyster, he is patient. He's secret. He's, I'll tell you what he's doing, because it says it here. He's hiding in inner treasures. This is what I was saying about his emotions. He's hiding there, right? And he just, his focus and determination is what gets him through. He knows how to focus, and, and, you know what I mean? And he uses his willpower very good because anything an oyster personality puts their mind to, right, they can achieve with grace and charm. And this is exactly what he does, isn't it? The only problem is oyster types often take their inner gifts for granted and maybe loves itself, right? So they become shy or doubtful. I can see shy in him. And this can lead to withdrawing or protecting their deepest desires and life's work. When the oyster card appears, it's important to reveal your inner treasures. What is it you've been hesitant to share? The world is waiting to see. I know what that, me that end bit of message was. It's for me. And you shouldn't put stuff for me in the, in here. I know what I have to share. And I'm not doing it in the middle of this. So, when in when this oyster is in balance, this Brad Pitt, this Joe Black, beautiful heel, right? <laughs> is he a heel? Who knows? Right? Maybe not to you. Because everybody brings different things out in, in, in different people. But when he's in balance, right, he feels blessed and he's just and he's generous and he's masterful, Achilles, yeah. Um, but when he gets out of balance, he's reluctant, he's reluctant and he's gripping onto things and he can shout, shh, he can clam up and go down here uh, and maybe not work on them good enough, just... It might take him a long time, I don't know. But what you have to do, Brad, right, when you get like that, you have to share something. That's it's exactly as it's written, right? Everything is written, right? Everything that's happening to me now it is absolutely each second, each moment, right, is synchronicities every minute, all of the time. So that was Brad Pitt. So I'm, da I'm down to two, and, I'm, and I don't have to tell you, right? You don't have to tell me. You don't have to tell anyone, right? <laughs> Leave it to me. I tell the world everything. So, right, now there's three. Now then, what I was going to ask you was, oh, I forgot one. Oh, no, one more, one more, one more. I forgot one. Right. I don't know who's who now. Johnny Depp. There's Doubting Thomas. He doubts. 
his heart, he, he, he doubts because he's protecting his heart all the time. Um, right, so, who's this? The heel. The sexy heel. Right, this next one. If you were with this next one, this person, what would it be like? Right. I know it's not, I know I'm not saying the same thing for each one. It doesn't matter. Right. So, this one, have you got them? You got them in your head? Right. What would it be like with this one? Oh, uh oh. Uh oh, it's Saturday. Oh, there's two of you. Uh oh. Oh, my lordy lord. Oh, oh, this is going to be hard. Right, whoever you've got your in your head, this would be hard to resist, you know. It, it would be hard to resist because they are the ace of cups. You would ace everything because this person is, is a, can be a wheel of fortune for you, right? Could be this whoever this person is you're thinking now, um he would give you his heart, right? Um because he's he can fix you. You can fix each other. He he would make the wheel turn. All of these would make the wheel turn once you've found your twin flame. You've, uh, you've absolutely... If you find your twin flame, you're right, you're spinning. You're spinning and glitching and everything. But this person is a good match. Now why didn't the three come out, I wonder? Three's a company, see them threes get in the way all the time. I don't know his business. I don't know his business. I just... I just like him. So, be, um, because, let's have a look, this last card there, he's victory. Now really? Now really? He's victory, is he? This is, do you know who this is? This is Martin from Coldplay. <laughs> he's really tall. Look. I'm only five foot, he's dead tall. His heart's beautiful. He's starting again, I think. I don't know his business, but it looks like to get, when you're at an ace, you've aced one. You've, when you come to the ace, right, what it means is you've, you've already um, got past the tens. You've passed that cycle. You've aced that last cycle. You are now at the beginning of a cycle in love this is where he is this is how he would be with you you would have victory right because he he's a he's a star full of he's just a star full of it <laughs> star full of skies and he can fix you so I'll tell you who he is. These will tell me who exactly who he is. <laughs> will tell me exactly if I if I've got it right or not, or I've missed something. So you've got your four. Ooh, there's a few wanting to come out there, I, and I know what that means. I'll tell you straight after this. Oh no, he can't, he can't be all them. He can't be all them. <laughs> he can't be all these. I'll do it again, but. What we've got for him, right? I have to show you because <laughs> that he's a peacock, right? He's also a unicorn, right? He's also the crow, which is obvious because he is he got himself on top of the world, Martin, didn't he? And he sings, he sings his messages, he creates what he what he he he's, he is. I, I create what I see. So, he is a perfect match for me. He is a swan. And there's the elk. I'm glad it wasn't the deer. I don't want to cry today. But, yeah, he's 
that's a bit hidden of him. He's full of the elk of it. <laughs> and he sings like a nightingale. I suppose he can have them, can't he? I suppose he is. I suppose that's what they wanted to give him. And I've just seen that's what they wanted to give him. And I've just seen a frog. Hold on, I'll show you. I've just seen the, the, the frog on the bottom, right? Yeah? And do you know what that means? Exactly what I was going to tell you about this, right? So you can do all this. You could do it yourself, right? Um, or some that I've got laid out, you can just put another name to. Um, whichever one you're drawn to, which was, what's, who's that? Johnny the Emperor, the Survivor. Tom, wicked humour, protecting his heart, that it would be justice for me and him. Oh, I didn't realise that before. Now, here we have. Pure joy, right? The hidden pearl is Mr. Hale with his Achilles, right? And then we have Martin. Now I'm still, I'm still, there's three still in it. How many have you got in it? There's, I've got still three in it. So, that means exactly what I was saying before. Because when you look at all these anyway, and any more that I'll pull for you, really, you want them all, don't you? You want all the traits of all the men. And they want all the traits of all the women. That's what you want to be. That's what you want to... You want an emperor and they want an empress. And that's where you have to both get to. At the same time, by the way, in divine timing, which I always play war about, but I know that it's correct because it's doing it to me right now. It's been doing it to me for ages. So, um, I can't choose, can you? I can't choose at all. See, you, all you've got to remember is that, that they've just got to come, come towards you correctly. Or not at all. That's what that's what you've got to that's what you've got to do. And the thing being, like I said, I'm forgetting one thing here. That my belief is that they will find you anywhere from outer Mongolia with his heel in his hand. They'll find you. So why are we doing all this? I'll tell you why we're doing all this. We do it for the thrill of it. <laughs> I'll put a song below. That's why we do it. For the thrill of it. So, I hope you have a good Saturday. I've just had to come on. Right, because you might not read anything that I put on these. Right, you might just listen, like Curly in the bath. Right, so, what I was going to say was, it might be, when we do all this, all this searching, right? I've told you, just don't care about who they are, right? And then they care about you, even though they don't know who you are. It, it's all right. Everything's a paradox. This whole universe is duality. Um, so, what I was going to say was, I forgot, didn't I, that the frog was on on the bottom. And, and that's probably precisely how it'll go. You'll have to kiss a frog. Mm -hmm.